Street. Hi, um, welcome to another episode of Fire Hungry. Yes, Fire Hungry. We're back. Hair situation. It's somewhere around lunchtime. I'm famish. I hungry. Starving. Can't talk about it. And we are going to a new restaurant. I know you're wondering why am I alone? Don't I have a co-host? Good eye. My co-host is currently not in the car. My co-host is like in like I don't know. My co-host is kind of out of commission right now. What if it's just me? We'll just have to adjust. Anyway, I'm kidding. He's coming. But yeah, I'm prepping y'all for what's about to go down. So we're gonna try a new place. Uh, obviously, you could try to guess where it is. But in a few seconds, we will show you where we're going. And yeah, that's it. That's all I have to say. Happy lockdown. Yes! Happy lockdown. I hope everybody in the Bahamas, well, let me not lie, everybody in Nassau is having a swell lockdown, you know, a prosperous lockdown. Um, that's all we could wish for at these times. Like, you know, we are not new to this. Remember, we're true to this. So, that's about it. Shall we go? Show, but we'll discuss getting it back in. Yes. It's crazy. We are hungry. We are hungry. Look at me! Look at my <laughs> face! Don't do it. <laughs> no! It's, wait, wait, wait a minute. That was getting too real quick. Look at me! You have a business. Don't do that. <laughs> That's it. Everyone, anyway. All right, all right, but cool. we went to the Island Brothers. Obviously, right now, outdoor dining is closed, so everything is curbside pickup. But the process is very smooth. No indoors. Pay at the door. Get your food. Leave. And we were able to order it on the phone. So for food, I got the mahi mahi with the salad, um, which is already dressed, but it's a long baguette. He got the lamb burger. Also, it's salad because we are slim in Jesus. Hallelujah. Hi. Yo. So uh, we would have showed y'all the mahi burger and then the lamb burger. Um, so we both wow you saw that you saw that you saw how he just don't wait They said it was a salad Okay, so first off the bat My brother at Island Brothers get it my brother is like we got the salad because we were trying to be healthy But we definitely one of us should have got the fries to see the difference. So that's our bad. We got cut up lettuce with dressing um, so he's not impressed by the salad because no. he says it's a little just cut up in lettuce, but um I am a salad connoisseur, so we gonna see how the salad is. It's a Caesar salad, but the dressings are made. I like it. It's a Caesar salad. Is delicious. I taste mustard. A little Dijon. Hey, anybody else watch Food Network? You know what a Dijon must? Yes. Okay. I taste a little mustard, a little Dijon in it. It's homemade dressing for sure. To me, it's a mixture of a honey mustard dressing versus a Caesar. So it's fairly good. Um, and as y'all can see, we got a good chunk of it. Um, so the salad for me is good. My brother would prefer if the salad be more extensive. Onion. He likes the salads full of like vegetables, of vegetables and stuff. Tomato. Yeah. So now... We're going to get into the burger. Hold on. Disclaimer. It is a Caesar salad. I get it. 
but when they said a salad, I was thinking garden salad, but that's my fault. It's a good Caesar salad. Yeah, like, I feel like it's a good Caesar. Um, so now we're going to get into the actual Mahi Mahi burger, which I'll show y'all. Looks like a burger. I see pickles. The website mentioned, like, avocado sauce, so I'm excited. Excuse me, I'm busy. No lie. I'm trying the lamb burger. It saved them. It saved them. The lamb burger is delicious. This is everything. It's really good. Normally, you can see the texture of the lamb burger. You can tell people buy it from the stores and stuff like that. Or they kind of like, you know, make it so it looks like a hamburger. This real lime, I'm looking at it, it looks a little like pulled pork almost. Like, I wish I could record this. Um, anyway, but it looks like pulled pork. You get a delicious slice of pickles with it. Definitely tasted the pickles. The cheese is different too. It's, 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 it looks like raw cheese. I don't even know what to say. Oh my blessed Jesus, this is good. This is good. This is really good. Overall, the burger said no. The salad, salad no. But burger, yeah. I'm having a time. I'm having a soiree in my mouth. My mouth is a party. So let me show y'all what he means by the pulled. Sorry, let me show y'all what he means by the pulled pork situation that's happening. And I'll show y'all an inside. I guess the lamb is quite pull apart. Um, it was a it's lamb, lamb shoulder. It's actually lamb. So yeah, that's what he meant. Um, for me, my mahi, bur my mahi burger is quite delicious, quite good. The sauce they have on it is divine. I'm having a time. Okay, we're gonna switch sandwiches now. Okay, so we didn't switch because I couldn't taste my brother's lamb burger because he devoured it. And I was saving my mahi mahi thinking that we was gonna share, but. No, I, didn't. I didn't know you was eating lamb, actually. I'm just, I'm throwing away right now. You should taste a piece of this. I'm better than you. <laughs> taste a piece of this. The bad fucky petty, you know. Okay, no, taste a piece of this. You gotta taste a piece of it. You gotta do. Taste the mahi mahi. Tell me what you think. I'm going to taste the lamb leftovers. Just remind me of like a lamb shank. Usually people do burgers, like lamb burgers. Usually when people say lamb burgers, they're like processing it or like it's grounded and then formed into a potty. Mm -hmm. That's what I meant. This is different. Well, that's a lamb now. Mm-hmm. We got this little piece of Mai Mai just peeking out. Let me just see. It's a Mai Mai. Mai just needs a bite. Be rude. You need to taste it with the avocado I sauce. Did. I did. Really, I already bite. You I bite already it? Bite. Yeah, I'm not going to bite your thing twice. Oh, I get it. I wasn't watching. Mm -hmm. Want me to do it again? Let me, let me get your burger again. Y'all will know if you bite it or not. I don't I don't, I don't. have to judge him. God so basically, him. hard crust. Definitely. It's a baguette. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. Definitely a baguette. Um, the crunch brings a different texture, a different appreciation for that bite. Mm -hmm. um, the fish. Very firm, actually. Not really big, firm. Juicy. Juicy fish. This is delicious. And my lamb is lamb. There's no doubt in me that this is lamb. If this turns out to be something else other than lamb, it's very hard to believe. A hundred percent. We are going to come back to this place um, once they're open for outdoor dining or maybe indoor dining and check out the dining experience. But Curbs out allows you just to see what restaurants have at their very core, which is good food. And this restaurant has good food. Because, wow. Final reviews. I'm, I'm impressed. Came here a week ago. Couldn't find a seat outside before the new orders, right? Couldn't find a seat outside. It was very relaxing. Everybody was having fun. I already have a good selection of teas. What, what am I feeling? I'm feeling Mediterranean from this place. I'm feeling... Like I'm not here, like I'm not in Nassau right now. I feel like I just flew over to Europe and I'm trying something new. I 
unfortunately I like to take a plane so unless I'm on that plane I will never feel like I'm in another country <laughs> but this food matches um I this, is, like, this is not the Bahamian palate no but it's good it's no, like I don't creamy see, I don't see uh, greasy fried my chicken fried drive no coming out and appreciating the taste and, and the massage of flavors that, that comes with this one. I feel like I'm chopped. Like I legit wanna be like. I take it back. Not only the sandwich, the sauce, save. Mm. This green sauce on a simple bed of lettuce killed it. Killed it. The Caesar sauce. Okay. Um. That's it. So y'all, I find a review for this. You guess. Um, buy hungry review on three. One, two, three. Give a thumbs up. A huge thumbs up. I just had two thumbs, but I hold in the burger. Um, I feel like our rating is always out of five. For me, this is like easily a four point six, four point seven out of five. You wanna go through the whole thing? Let's do it. Branding. One, two, three, five. I feel like I feel like most people know about Island Brothers, so five, yeah. Customer branding, service. Customer service, five. I, think, I had no problems on yeah, the phone. It's not, it's not fair. It's very straightforward. Maybe they're going to be their best because of COVID. Right. No, no, no. Because a lot of restaurants out here aren't even answering the phone for orders. Or they're not even, like, paying attention to their Instagram. So, not paying attention to their social media. A lot of places out here are slacking. Excuse me. So, when you find a brand that's actually, like, doing, like, posting their menu on Instagram and being active on the internet, which is what we're using now. It's very noticeable. So I give it a five. I had an easy time ordering my food. I had an easy time collecting my food. I had an easy time eating my food. Food, food on three. One, two, three, four point five. Four point seven. This won't be difficult. I said what I said and I'm keeping it. Cool. Ambiance on three. One, two, three. Five. Oh, wow. Oh, that look nice. I don't know. I just feel like if you get out of the bar and do that and give me a mimosa, I would be. You cannot go inside. I know. So. All right, five. COVID. COVID. It's like you want them disobey menace. They legit abiding by all the laws of the country. Curbside service. So we got to do this. Time Curbside of, service time is Time of service. No area of rating for Boy Hungry. Time of service. They said it'll be ready in 20. When we arrive, he pulled it out. He didn't even want to hear who he is. He's like, we got your order. So time of service on three. One, two, three, five. five. I will five. always like... I was always I was always telling for companies and restaurants that are actually like good at what they do. I love the fact I love when I can order food and pick it up and there's no issues, there's no delay. They told us twenty minutes you reached in twenty five. And we still our food's still hot, it's still good. So yeah. This has been our review. Of this is the final score right here. Right here. Final score. Bye hungry. Right there. Bam. Bam. So this has been our review of island brothers we were so excited to do this one because we've heard great things about it this is my first time experiencing that food and i'm impressed so i'll definitely be back again and any little final thoughts from you as you I'm kill the food. salad I'm food. you remember when he said he didn't like the salad now we killing it interesting all right y'all thank y'all for watching um y'all know what y'all do best Thank you. If this is on YouTube, be sure to like, leave a comment, and subscribe. Um, and thank y'all so much for supporting us. We'll see y'all in the next episode. Leave a comment down below on what, what restaurant y'all want us to go to next. Bye.